Hey, 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 hey guys, it's Jerrell Snow's Random Planet, and we are back here with yet another random scary game. 616 Games is the same studio, the same developers that brought out Truth Loop, which we played not too long ago here. As you can tell by that, uh, that thump, 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 thump. Um, we are probably going to move the camera here. We'll, we'll guess. We'll guess. I'm going to go ahead and guess. We're going to go a little bit smaller here, just in case. Um, off to the bottom left here. Hopefully it's the best here. Oh, dear Lord. Um, game volume, mouse sensitivity, vertical. Yeah, let's not have vertical look. We're on Ultra. Uh, I do have this monitor, even though it's a ultra widescreen monitor. I have this monitor specially set to 1920 by 1080 just for the recordings to look proper. Otherwise, it would be way across the top. If you look at some of my early videos, those were definitely that way. But this is another one of those VHS style games. Um, which I'm really, really confused about. Uh, because if I'm correct, in Truth Loop, that is the one where we continuously kept on trying to go pick up our girlfriend or wife and they did have a quite a good setting um in there to kind of get rid of the heavy heavy vhs vibe because they can be a little a little bit much which i did, did did enjoy that they gave us like five different settings there direction of creation Raphael bars D dude all right so it's the same person as yasmin bofim yeah the same people as the other game that i played that i enjoyed quite a bit carl jc i really like where they're going with this i really do um apparently they have quite a few games and we're gonna drop them a follow after this and kind of kind of check out the other games as well because if this one is anything like Truth Loop and the fact that I did like that, um, oh, okay, I'm a little confused here. I thought we were in the elevator and we were, we're, we're the front desk person at a hotel. Okay, um... Why are these crates here? Touch. Oh, it's the bell. Oh, because we can zoom. Okay, so you can see the front doors there. Oh, we can see the elevators over here. Okie dokie. Um, we're going to quickly... Oh, see, like right here, camera style. 1995 Horror VHS PSX PS2. Um, so if we do this, this is the PSX. The PS2 has a, is a nice, real clean setting that doesn't mess with... Fortunately, it doesn't mess with the eyes like a lot of my uh, my stuff do. All right, so hosts. Uh, Rubens Carlos, Daniel Alvarez, Cindy Campbell, Rita Stewart, Solano Pietro. I think it's Pietro. Solano Pietro, Kareem Musa, uh, Pasquale Salzano, Sara Fritz H. Marky Forrest. Albias Susano and Samuel L. I, I wonder if there's a Jackson after this. Smith Boyle. Oh god, there is a person there. Oh, that freaked me out. Hi, Kareem Musa. Was I taking too long for you? Ding. Um. Okay, that actually... Wow. We're just going to sit down. How about this? Tab the cursor. Get up! <laughs> oh. Oh, get up. <laughs> I thought it was yelling at me. Hi, Karibusa, how are you? Good evening, sir. I am staying in room 105. My room is Kareem Musa. Okay. Just a second, sir. I'll check. Oh, that's what this is. Okay. Which we know he is right there. Oh, so one, two, three, four. No, that doesn't work. It's just going to be first floor, second floor, third floor. That's what I'm guessing. Um, 
All right, you can go up, sir. Thank you, and good night. Okay. I've never really seen a hotel. Oh, what the hell? This elevator is kind of weird. Oh, this elevator is blocked off. What is this? Lost child. Have you seen this child? Shit, this elevator is driving me crazy. Alright, we can run. Can we go upstairs? We cannot. So, we are limited to... So, basically, I'm going to let visitors in, or people who stay here in. And kind of wait for whatever is going on with this elevator. Alright, so we can see the elevator right there. I'm not turning off that screen. I don't care what you say. Just in case I have to get up here. I have no idea what we're doing here. Like, I don't know what... I don't like the fact that people can just walk back here. Why can't this be, like, glass panels and buzzer and... <laughs> Buzz. Like, let's not, let's not let people come in, please? Hmm. Why do I have the feeling that something nice is going to get me? Or not nice is going to get me. Oh, another person. We'll run back. Oh. Oh. Hello, sir. Oh, you are fancy schmancy. You are super fancy. Look at you, Alan Alonzo. Hello, friend. I stayed here this morning. I'm sleepy. Can I go to my room? Just a second, sir. I'll check. Alan Alonzo. I don't remember seeing... Oh, no, there he is right there. I was turned to the third page. Apparently, it's... Fate. All right, you can go up, sir. Thank you, and good night. Are we just waiting? Wait. Oh, God, there's different... Oh, God. What the... Hi, buddy. What the hell? Um. Doesn't show him there. Go. Oh. Now he's no longer there. Uh, Scott T. Hey, man. I wanted to go to my room soon. I'm Scott. The second, sir. I'll check. Scott T. <laughs> Scotty. <laughs> um, nothing there. Nothing there. Okay, so we have our first no. Because I don't see a Scott. There's no Scott there. Double checking here. No Scott. Just stay an arm. There's no Scott. That is not on the list, I'm sorry. Go fuck yourself, you son of a bitch. Oh. Oh, God, he's outside the door now. Now he's right over there. Wait, what? Now he's back over here.
I don't want to sit down. Oh. Kind of a safe spot here. Can I reach this? Alright. Hmm. And I like this angle because it shows us everything. Oh, this has me on edge. Except it doesn't show me out the window. Alright, he's back over there. He's back over there. Is this like a situation where I'm supposed to walk out there to these guys? Or... Oh shit, he's right in front. There's no jump in here. All right, here goes nothing. Okay. Um... What in the living hell is going on here? I just saw the multiple different camera angles and I just realized, oh, well, you can press these these cameras. Oh, wait a second. It's It literally doesn't matter, the button. It's just... They automatically... That's, that's why the buttons weren't making sense. Okay. Hmm. I still think this is the best angle because it basically shows everything. I don't know what we're supposed to do. Like, is this purely just a waiting game? Don't like the fact that we can't look. Oh, or the fact that it really throws us off when we try to get up. Can the next person come in, please? I'm really confused. Okay, that's just me running across the carpet. Still nobody knew, huh? I don't know why we're touching that. It's got to have something to do with this, right? Oh, doesn't do anything. Do I have to go into the elevator? Yep. Hmm. Okay. I think I'm going crazy. I'm working too hard. Oh, dear lord. Okay. I had to go with, do with going into the elevator. Oh, hello. Oh my god, there's multiples of them. There's now two of them. Oh, there's now two of them. Hello, sir. How are you, Pasquale Salzano, that I already know your name is there? No, you cannot go to your room. You have to stay here with me. Uh, 
Hi, Mr. Salzano, just a minute. Um, no, I, oh, I mean, I know you're in this book and clearly he knows you. <sighs> good night and good work, friend. Hmm. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I really don't like this. Ah. Uh. All right, so I think I'm just supposed to go to the elevator again. Oh, you're in front again. Okay. All right. Oh, shit. The hell? Hotel 16, or 616, Josh, how can I help you? Good night, Josh. This is Detective Hoffman. I'm getting close. I'm calling to alert you of a murderer on the loose. Good night, Detective. A killer on the loose? Um, shouldn't have been hello, Detective. A killer on the loose? We are calling all the hotels in the area. He's a dangerous guy. Victims to are, are all children. My God, can you tell me more about him? Description of suspect, a tall, bald, bearded man. God, can you tell me more about him? Thanks for the warning, Detective. I'll keep an eye out. Thanks for your attention, Josh. Good night. How did you know my... Oh, because I said Josh. Oh, say, so, okay, so clearly... Oh, you're not there anymore. I'm going crazy. I'm working too hard. Um. Apparently we're calling the elevator. Oh, I can't get into it. Okay. Um. Now the elevator is open again. Now it's closed again. It's Now I think I look at this poster. That's the lost child. All right, you're open now. We still can't get in. Okay. Um, very confused. Oh! Hello? Oh, go around to the front of the desk. Thank you. I'm going to need to go, Josh. If anyone let, looks for me, let me know. Wait. Were these kids reaching out for him? Wait a second. Pasquale's the killer. All right. Tell me what you need. Tell me what you need, kid. You're the kid missing in the photo. It's Pasquale, isn't it? He's pointing. Look at that. I'm freaking out. It is Pasquale. That's what you were telling me. Can I call? Or do I have to wait for him to come back? I go up. No. So it's not a match to kill his characteristics. I'll notify the police. Okay. He's going to come kill me while I'm doing this. How can I help you? I just give Josh to the front desk of the Hotel 616. Some important for me. There's a guy who matches the characters as an assassin. Just left the hotel. Thanks for the info. I'll send a friend over to check it out. Okay. Oh, he's gonna come back. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. 
He's gonna kill me. He's so gonna kill me. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. I'm sorry, Mr. Salzano. I didn't see you there. Did something happen, Josh? You look very nervous. Oh, no, buddy. It's okay. How was your walk? Invigorating. You sure it's okay? You're sweating. It's good. Don't worry. You're just tired. I think you're hiding something. Aren't we friends? I hide anything. I told you everything is fine. Shit. Okay, he's just going upstairs. I thought he was coming. This one is close. He's very suspicious. He's going to come back and get me. Okay, blood is dripping on top of the elevator. Oh no. Seam will never get out of my head. What do I do? Um... Oh, God! Oh, that was evil. That was so evil. That was so evil! That was so freaking evil. Okay, so that was, oh, that was interesting. That was interesting. That was evil. That was evil. Like, because I didn't know exactly what to do, so you kind of had to walk around it. I thought eventually that they were coming in and stuff like that. They were not. Um, I wonder if you can get a different ending on this. You might be able to, if, if like, if I started exploring much earlier. Um, before he came in, and I was able to find that body prior maybe that would be a little bit different. However, I'm not 100% sure about that, um, and I'll leave that up to you to be able to decide and find. If you guys would like to be able to check out the elevator, it's a dollar on Itch.io, and uh, honestly, if uh, if you guys are interested in checking it out, I will leave a link down in the description and the pinned comment below. Um, if you guys want to see me live over on Twitch, I'll be going back live on Twitch uh, tomorrow, actually. Uh, Twitch.tv forward slash random planet. As always, guys, may the spoops be with you during these tough times. Please remember you, your friends, your family, and your loved ones. Please stay safe out there. We will see you guys again next time on the next Random Scary Games video. Bye-bye for now. That was evil.